morning friends this is Jennifer with the magic brush hey I just got to um, work today and I thought why didn't I bring my big camera so I could tape what I'm about to do for you guys because I do think this is something that perhaps several of you could benefit from um, I have a client with these faded out uh, exterior lights I'm trying to tape me and tape the light at the same time see how the light fixture especially if we look on top if I can move that just looks really really faded um, it used to be more of a deep bronze and a chocolate color and they have faded out on her so I am going to work today at um, darkening it back up and intensifying the color for her and thought perhaps you guys could glean some tips from this so I'm using two different modern masters colors I'm gonna see if I can show you what's on my little tray here one is um, English Brown from Modern Masters. The other is Black and Bronze. And this is my tool of choice. If you guys have been following my Facebook page for long, you'll know that this is a men's shaving brush that they apply the old-fashioned um, shaving cream with. And I'm literally just going to dab my brush, I hope you can see that, into a little bit of the dark paint. Then I'm going to offload it onto a paper towel. And um, let's see if you guys can watch what I'm doing here. I'm going to put just a little bit of the dark on first. And I know that looks scary, looks a little bit like hen scratches. Can you guys see that, I hope? Then I'm gonna go back and dip the black and bronze onto my shaving brush. And I'm going to try to kind of fade that in. And so I'm gonna just keep working this, keep working this, keep working this. I'm not trying to kill the original color at all. I'm just trying to um, deepen it back up, blend it back in, and give it a little bit of new life. So, the reason I have some newspaper up here, see how pretty that is? It's gonna be gorgeous. The reason I have some newspaper is most lights are not attached, uh, the glass is not attached to the frame. And so if you just slip a little piece of newspaper in there, like so, then you're able to work on this area without it getting all over the glass and without having to tape that. So, I hope that is helpful. I don't know if you could see any of that that I was doing, I'm trying to, Film me and film the light at the same time. So anyway, have a great day, you guys. If you have any questions, let me know. Otherwise, make sure you're watching the Magic Brush Facebook page and website for more tutorials. Thanks so much. Bye-bye.